have uh, said a while? No, nope, not at all. <sighs> what you're trying to do here, John, what you're trying to accomplish is pretty noble. I don't know if it's noble. I'm just... I'm going to tell you a story. Sure. I have this horse. I'm getting a bit ahead of myself. I had this horse. Magnificent animal. Well, one night I got to drinking. And went down to the barn and, you know, shared a few laughs. One thing led to another. You know how things are. By the end of that magical night, John and I had my penis inside that horse's vagina. We made penis vagina sex all night long. It was wonderful. Anyway, in the cold, sober morning light, I woke up and I turned to her and I said, what have we done? Well, you know, women, she lost it. You know, thought I was unhappy, thought I'd only had penis vagina sex with her because I was drunk. Well, God damn it, John, I didn't put my penis inside that horse's vagina because I was drunk. I did it because I loved her. I need you to prove that alcohol doesn't influence the choices we make in life. That way, she'll see that it wasn't alcohol that made me have penis vagina sex with her. And then she'll realize that it was love and only love that made me want to, you know, have... Penis vagina sex with her, right? Yeah. Listen, I'm not doing this so you can justify fucking a horse. I'm sorry. John, she's more than a horse to me. Without her life's a nightmare. But with her, <laughs> there's a right there.